Alright boys, we bought the compound starlet down the engine to exhaust. We have no idea what this is about to rattle off. You haven't told Gordon yet, but if it hits Bruce Cut, we're just gonna turn it off. Soon find out. So we've had a bit of a misfire, I can't see anything in the logs, it looks like it, so it might be the spark plug out, we're just gonna, just gonna come down a bit. So we did go to turn off the boost cut, but it's not saying that it's cutting yet, so. Yeah. I just turn it off anyway. Yeah, we'll knock the plug cap down a bit, because it's probably getting a lot more air than it was before. Mm. And then we'll go again. I don't even know if we ended up gapping these plugs down. I don't think we did. Mm. Yeah, so Matt gapped the plugs down a bit. It looked like cylinder two was the one that was misfiring the EGTs and that did have a slightly bigger gap than the others, so. So boots cut off. This is it, this is the honey shot. This is the run. I can already see Nick's gonna put the rev limiter up, you watch. The last run, 51 pounds. I gave her a little bit more timing, I wanna do one more run. Did you rate the RPM a smidgey? You wanna? Just like 150 RPM. So we did say in the last video, we're not leaving until she makes 600. I don't know what Nick's gonna do. Shaking, my hands are sweaty. This could be an explosion.
What is the what is the thumbs up mean? I put a little smidge of fuel in her. Let's see what she does. So we lifted the head, 591 horsepower, this close to 600. We need some bigger head studs.